so in this video we will see how to how you can create a activity indicator activity indicator is basically a loader in real life scenarios in whenever you use an app and you press something or swipe up and down uh, you obviously see a loader or activity indicator it means that the server is trying to fetch data from the backend and in the meantime they are showing you the loader so that you can uh, come to know that the process is going on and after few seconds you get your data so just like that uh, we will create an app in which we will be creating a text input in which user will enter their name and when we press button activity indicator will be show for three seconds and after three seconds we will get our alert so just open a react native project and open it in visual studio code i already opened the ios simulator if you are using windows machine then you can open android simulator okay so let me just clear clear this terminal okay so first of all let me just import text input bless all the enter your name and change text when you just start typing it the text whichever is in inputs will be saving this in name state let us first of all create that state by default it will be an empty string let us also create a state for the activity indicator for the boolean value to turn it on and off let me just name it so By default, if it be turn off, so it will be false. Let me give some styling to text input. Let's say background color yellow. Padding will be twenty. Let me just then. So here is our text input. Now let me just import activity indicator. Let me just show you guys how it will look. The first prop that we can provide is size we can provide either large or small let me provide large we can also provide color let's say red okay so let me just save it as you can see let me provide margin bottom It also has one more props it calls animating by default it will be 
true animating means uh, whether it should be visible or not if it's true then it's visible and if i write false then it disappear okay so now let us create a button title of the button will be show on press event we will be creating a function let's say uh, click me now let us create that function counts click me so first of all let us use this saw state in animating by default it will be false so when user click on the button we will change show stand to true so then user can see the indicator now the indicator will up will stay on the screen for 3 seconds and for that i'll be using set timeout Here we can provide the number of seconds let's say 3000 milliseconds it's in milliseconds so whatever i write in this function set time up, it will uh, it will get called after 3 seconds so after 3 after 3 seconds i want show style to be false let us write alert welcome welcome to our app let us also console the name that user enters let me just save it so here i have uh, applied show state to animating and by default it's false so when i click on show it should turn it should uh, set this show state to true then after three seconds it will pop an alert alert and the uh, and the print the name of the console so let me just write my name let me just click as you can see the indicator is shown after three seconds it appears welcome to our app and it also write the name of the console let me just save it to let's say two seconds and Tony as you can see and so basically this is how you can use loader or activity indicator in your app in our future videos we will learn how to fetch the data from the api and in there we will use this activity indicator so in the meantime when we fetch we are fetching the data from the api we show this indicate activity indicator to the users. So thanks for watching.